The Plymouth Public Schools completed a thorough renovation of the Blake Planetarium last August. The Planetarium, which is located at Plymouth Community Intermediate School, opened its doors to the public on August 21st, the day of the eclipse, to show off the upgrades. Recently, the district decided to host public educational events, and PCN stopped by for the Out of This World experience. As a gift from town meeting, we received approximately a quarter million dollars, and through that we were able to remove the old equipment, we were able to get the dome cleaned and painted, and we were able to get all of the new equipment that we needed, plus all of the required software. The system is the equivalent to that uh, which is in Boston at the Science Museum. We were open for the eclipse in August, and there was such a huge response from the community and interest. We have been open since the school year began running programs for the kids in Plymouth. Our focus is on students, it will always be on students. But since everything has really been fine-tuned, we have open to the public and we now do ticketed shows. So we've had one ticketed show, we had also our rededication ceremony, and so this is our second ticketed show. Huge response from the community, uh, definitely what we have heard so far, they love it. The tickets that we sell go back into purchasing new licenses. So we will continue to kind of feed that system so the more folks who come will be able to see more shows. What's really great about this system is that it takes the old system, which was just from the perspective of Earth, and it changes it so that when we're doing astronomy-based activities, we can actually be in the perspective of the Milky Way. We can be outside the Milky Way. We can be standing on Mars. We can be in any place that you could conceivably think of um, and not have to be standing on the Earth for the astronomy aspect. Because of the capability with the video, we're also able to do many more things than just astronomy. For instance, Habitat Earth, which we're showing tonight, is really life science, earth science, and um, space science as well. So it definitely has a lot more functionality. We can have EdTV do programs. We can have students in high school who are using Unity software in the gaming program. They're able to also program and bring things into the planetarium as well. So the um, boundaries are endless. We've tried to make the whole experience of coming to the planetarium be interesting, not just for astronomy buffs and kids who love the sky, or in adults for that matter, but we've, we've really tried to make it be something where you could learn in the community. 